Hi, I'm here with uh, Richard from Ignis Software, and uh, he's going to show us uh, the upcoming updates to the BBC Podcast Lounge app. Okay, so uh, the updates in this version allow you to um, basically sync um, your favourite podcasts um, in an offline format. So, very familiar interface to, to those who've already got the, the podcast player. Um, but basically, the features and functionality in, in this version that's due to be released uh, pretty soon will allow you to, uh, it will effectively, whilst your phone is charging overnight, whilst it's on power, whilst it can see a Wi Fi network, it will pull down the, uh, the latest um, episodes of your favourites. Um, so basically, we, we, we step into say Hard Dock, for example, um, the uh, uh, okay. struggling mobile signal here, but limited on the three G. <laughs> absolutely. So, um, so basically, you, you can tell the player, I want to listen to the, the three most recent episodes of Hard Talk. Um, it will go off and download them, and the next time you load up the app, you're presented with a, a, a welcome screen that says, "While you're away, we downloaded the uh, some episodes for you." So it's constantly keeping synced and up to date. So a bit like the Zoom service you've got today, okay. but without the faff of needing to leave a computer on overnight to force the syncing, um, actually this is fully self-contained within the app. So, so for, from, e- from each podcast you can go into each one specifically, sub- uh, you know, effectively subscribe to it, Correct. Uh, and then you can say, okay, I want uh, I want to keep the l- one latest one, the second latest one, or the third latest one. Absolutely. Uh, when I'm plugged in, just go off and get those podcasts yes. and, uh, and download it. Yes. So, I mean, do you want to show us uh, the actual UI for how, how that will actually work? So the, uh, there is some control in the settings. Um, so if you drop drop into settings, you get the option to uh, auto download auto download my favourites. Yeah. And you can choose to sync either the, the, the single newest episode, the sec- top two newest episodes, or the top three newest episodes. And there's a little bit of text in there that just warns you that uh, that will only happen when the phone's on charge, when the battery's in a good good state, and it, it can see a valid Wi-Fi connection. Okay. And, and with this, you can uh, you can override those uh, conditions, can you? Or no, that's that's actually no, there. Part, part, of, part, part of the oper- operating system yeah. and their hard They coded. prevent that. Yeah. But okay. uh, in, in a good way because the, the resource intensive tasks that we use to download, and some of these podcasts are 60, 70 yeah. uh, megs yeah. in size. They're very big, yeah. Actually, I'd rather that happen when the phone was on charge by my bedside than when I was on a phone call. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so it, 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 it works very nicely um, and, and sits, in the, sits in the background. And uh, you get a, it, it's, it's great when you load the app and it, it comes up and says, Well, you're all right, we don't have these, uh, these podcasts yeah. and they're ready to go for your commute in the morning or for that that flight that you're you're on and you want, want somebody to listen to. That's cool. And is there any is there any other UI changes or anything like that in there that are um, uh, you know coming in this uh, latest release? The only other thing in this release if we just if we just drop into Scott Mills and see what he's got on there um, is uh, some social networking um, support in there. So on on the playback you've got the uh, social networking icon which sure. allows cool. you to, to, to send a, a tweet saying Oh nice. I'm, I'm and, and that it. just uses the existing uh, Windows Phone Correct. API yeah. to to share out to whatever social networks are on there. That's correct. Yeah. Very good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cheers.